Now you know we're advancing this drift because there's huge gold nuggets coming out of here. And we're also driving down the main sump because there's a lot of fine gold down there. Well, we wanted to keep driving this drift forward, but as we're running our track back here, we encountered a problem. Let's see how many of y'all out there are smart fellers and not just fart smellers. Because we need a very specific piece of equipment down here so that we can keep pushing this drift forward. Ooh, what do you think that is, huh? Come on now, you guys gotta know what that is. One problem we're having is metal detecting because because the metal rails obviously are affecting the detector and that's right where the gold is. So we're just gonna blow this whole section out, run everything. Now remember we had that little tiny flat car in here, I'm sure you remember that. But the problem is, is that we can't get our skip bucket onto that flat car to run it back here to fill it up. So what are we gonna do? If anybody out there said, Jeff, use an ore car, give yourself a pat on the back, son of Jim, because that's exactly what we're doing. Now because an ore cart won't fit down the shaft, we're gonna have to do just like the old timers did, and we're gonna bring it down piece by piece. And then we're gonna reassemble it piece by piece. There it is, piece by peace. That's right. That's a lot of fun right there, son of Jim. Like I always say, who needs a gym? Just be a gold miner. It'll test your metal real good like. All right, enough of this jaw jacking. Let's get this thing put together because we have a whole bunch of gold to pull out and we're going to be running it through the wash plant today. That's right. We're going to be running this and we're going to be running the stuff out of the sump together. Ooh, I know you can't wait to see that. I can't wait to see that either. And then I got a big surprise for you. That's right. So just keep them pants on, son of Jim. cool now i got my own ore car down here to run around in i'll fill this thing up dump it into our skip bucket and away we go not only dumps but it also rotates just like a regular ore cart and it's got the latch on it too unlatch dump i can twist it from side to side you see that and it's so balanced it just one-handed i can do this isn't that cool and there's a little dowel right there that goes up into this hole so when you close it it locks into position, you see that? Just like a regular ore cart. Then you got the latch down here, and we got a little ball welded on so it can't come off. See that? Oh, I can't wait to fill it up. Hey, you guys want to fill it up now? Oh, I'm sorry, what? Yeah. Ah! Well, if you want to see me fill it up, you better smash that like button, smash it real hard.
Yeah, look at that. Knocked out a big old section of it. Now the gold is down there, so that's where we gotta muck this out. Woo, who needs a gym? Just be a gold miner. Some people explore mines, some people own mines, but only we dig mines from start to finish. And I'll tell you what, it'll test your metal too. All right, so we're gonna muck all this out. And if you notice, I put down a muck sheet. It's gonna make digging off these rails a lot easier. That's how the old timers used to do it. This is all waste material here. The good stuff is right down here, but I gotta get this out of the way so I can get in there. So I'm gonna get all this waste material into our new ore cart, see how it does. Man, I wish I had somebody to help me down here. Do I got any takers, huh? Yeah, there's no couch and there's no chips down here, so I guess that means no. All right, let me get this muck out of here. You better smash that like button, smash it real good, boy. I ain't gonna do nothing. Uh, look at that, just about cleared it all out in one shot. Not bad, huh? There's my muck sheet right there. So much easier to dig off of that. How much you think that weighs, huh? That's a full load right there. I wonder if it'll fill up my skip in one shot. Because if it does, I know exactly how much it weighs. But look at this, look how easy I can roll this. One hand, Sonny Jim make my job so much easier. Now we can really get some gold out of here. I tell you what, let me ring the bell so I can get the missus to drop that bucket and get this stuff out of here. I'm curious to see. Yeah, I know I got to build an apron for it and all that stuff. It's coming right now. Got myself an ore car. Oh yeah. There's my pegboard right there. That way I know how many loads I've got. There she comes on the run with burger on the bun. Yeah, no, I need to build an apron for it. That'll be next right here. There's a few things that I got to fix on it, but for the most part, it works pretty good. All right, now we're going to go ahead, blow out all that gold bearing gravel. And then I'm going to dig some of this ugh, red dirt out from the sump where that worm lives. Ugh, I got to clean it out anyway. I'll get all that put together in sandbags, and then we're going to run it through the wash plant. Ooh, I know you can't wait to see what comes out of that and that. Ugh, nasty worms. Ugh. All right, we're gonna start with this stuff first. This is the oversized. And if there's any giant nuggets, it's either gonna be in that nugget trap or it's gonna be here. Now, I don't need to put jet dry in my water because I left the bottle upside down, like I said. 
and it drained all it out. So that's why I got all those soapy suds. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, wouldn't that be nice, huh? Oh, soon, I'm telling you. A whole bunch of heavies and caliche, but no giant nugget. Ugh. Ooh, that's heavy. That's real heavy. Nothing but black sand. And a lot of that clay. Ugh. It's all stuck. Stuck on the bottom. Come on. There. Got all my cons right there. The bucket's clean. Alright, now the moment of truth, huh? Had that window blow me away. Come on, baby. Ew, is that a worm? Nah, <laughs> just kidding. Come on, baby. Daddy needs a new pair of shoes. Wow. Nothing but black sand. Look at that. Solid. Holy cow. That is a lot of black sand. That's gonna be hard to pan. All right, I'm gonna slow down because that gold likes to hang up with that black sand. Especially that fine gold. Ooh, I can see, ooh, I can see gold already. I can see it already. Little tiny pieces. All right, come here. I want you to see what I see. All right, let's pan this together. See the gold right there? You see it? All the little tiny pieces. Isn't that nice? Ooh, I can see them. Yeah. All right, let's, let's do a shake back real quick. See what we got. Oh, I'm seeing some pieces. I'm seeing some pieces. Ooh, what is that, a piece of quartz? How's that stuck in there? Ooh, oh, <laughs> that's why it's stuck in there. Ooh, look at that. Big old chunker. Oh, it's got a chunk of quartz stuck to it. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Mmm, ton of black sand. Look at that. That's all gold in there. That's nothing but gold. Wow. Now that's a pan full of gold. Oh. Look at that. Solid. Solid pan of gold. Oh. Look at the fines. All the way down to 50, maybe 100 mesh. Big old flakes. Ooh, I can't wait to get that big chunker out of there. Hold on, let me clean this up. Oh man, that is a lot of gold. That is nice. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get this cleaned up and put a snapshot on it. 
I forgot. I got a big announcement for you too, a big surprise. Remember I was gonna tell you that? Keep them pants on, boy, cause here it comes. Oh yeah, that'll give it flavor. So what's the big surprise? Oops. Ugh. Well, all the gold that we get from the drift mine goes to our premium patrons, and most of you know that. But what you may not know is that we got a tour coming up. That's right, three day gold mining tour. That's some of the richest ground Arizona's got. But not only that, we got some new product lines out I wanna show you. Oh, you're gonna love this. Like I always say, who needs a gym? Just be a gold miner. Hey, and who's that sexy young fellow on the front there? It's a strapping young lad there, laddie. So we just got this one in. And oh, I know you guys are gonna love it. Of course, my favorite is, and yeah, you're gonna get wet. Ooh, and you can wear it on date night. And of course, the ladies' favorite. Nice lump, show. Now, for those of you out there that don't have a clue, as to what I'm talking about, allow me to educate you, son. All the gold that comes out of that drip mine goes directly to our premium patrons. It's our way of saying thank you for helping us keep the dream alive, because without them, none of this would exist. But they're also eligible to come out on our gold mining tours like I talked about, our three-day gold mining tours. How do you like them nuggets, huh? Almost as good as my cowboy style eggs and beans. And now is a perfect time to sign up as a premium patron because we're gonna have the sign up page go live this Sunday. So if you hurry and sign up now, you become eligible to come out on that three day gold mining tour. Not only that, but after you sign up, you'll have access to Slim Store, which has all the merchandise that you saw, plus a whole bunch of other stuff you're not gonna see anywhere else. The book that we wrote, Where to Find Gold by Jeff and Slim. It's got 30 years of experience packed into this monker, and the graphics are incredible. I guarantee you're gonna love this book. If you don't find gold after getting this, something's wrong with you. Now, does this sound like something you wanna be a part of? I'm telling you. And with gold prices pushing $2,000 an ounce, you'd be crazy not to. So what do you gotta do to become a premium patron? It's really easy. Just look for the little icon at the end of the video that looks something like that. Click on it, make a $10 pledge, and you're in like Flynn. But you may wanna hurry because them tours sell out real fast like. Now if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you smash that like button. Come on, you know the drill. And if you're not subscribed, consider subscribing because we have all kinds of fun on this channel. So you just might learn something too. Well, I'm gonna get on out of here because I gotta have my breakfast, my cowboy style eggs and beans. I gotta have something to eat before I go back to work in those gold mines. So until next time, this is Jeff Williams and who? My name is Jeff. <laughs> saying, you want to go metal detecting for gold nuggets because that's what you've always wanted to do? Sign up as a premium patron, son, and you'll be getting fistfuls of AU. Take care, everybody.